uh, this is the manifest file we talked about. Uh, it is must for each application and the name must be kept same and the name should be Android manifest.xml. The purpose of this manifest file is to present essential information to the Android system like this names the Java package for the application. It describes various components of the application. It declares the permissions application must have to interact with other applications. So this, this is another new uh, concept of permissions. If my application wants to have an access to uh, context database, I must ask for this permission in Android manifest.xml. Advantage of this permission is when my application gets installed, Android system is going to show the list of these permissions to the end user during installation, which makes the end user aware all these permissions are required by this application. An end user may choose to install or not to install this application if he sees any risk in installing the application. In case end user sees application is asking for a permission which is not really required, end user may choose not to install that application. Then in this file you need to declare the permissions that others are required to have in case they want to use your application. This is a brief about uh, application resources.